Good morning, everyone. Happy New Year. You know, I literally told myself that I was going to film as soon as I wake up, but I completely forgot. I was even going to film the toasted bagel that I made. I made a toasted cheese bagel sandwich. Well, cheese and mayo. This is all that's left of it. <laughs> Today, we're doing some fun stuff. I already started making my vision board for this year. I think I'm going to... I, I need to complete that today, but at least get somewhere today. Because I've, like, I've just journaled all the ideas down. I need to find pictures and stuff. And then I think I'm going to go see a friend today. I'll see if I film that or not. I, I don't think I'm going to film that. If I go see the friend, then I'm also going to buy a new journal for the new year. Because I actually, I have a few pages left of my journal from this year. Okay, no, I did journal a lot. But like, it was maybe since like October, yo, I was just... I was journaling maybe once in a few weeks, which I need to stop. This year, it's a reset. I don't want to say new year, new me, but we're definitely getting a reset this year. So I'm going to try journal often, as often as I can. While I'm having my toasted cheese, I'm also drinking some green tea. And then I was actually just watching Jujutsu Kaisen like right now. Well, re-watching it because this is like my third time watching it. You know, I was actually gonna go to the gym this morning, but mm -mm -mm. it's like the worst day to go to gym because everyone has an epiphany that they're going to start gymming for the new year. So I, I'll just I'll just go on Monday as I usually do. I never go on the weekends, but I skipped one day this week. But yeah, that's the tea there. And also the weather today, it's like pretty gloomy and there's like, I think it's gonna rain a bit. I'm not even sure, but like I hate driving when it's like storming outside. But if the rain's not like terrible, then I think I'll still get out the house. But if it is terrible, I'm staying home and then we'll just chill together here. Okay, update. I um, decided to stay home. Well, I'll just not really stay home but like i'll see my friends sometime during the week yeah this was supposed to be like a very productive day and now it just turned into probably one of my most laziest days that i'm gonna have for the whole year i don't know how to feel about it i like there's a part of me that like wants to be like no it's fine you know i deserve the rest it's school holidays it's literally the first day of the year like take it slow kind of vibe but it's like I want it to be productive, but it's fine, I guess. Now, like, when I tell you, like, I'm productive day, as in, like, it's literally three in the afternoon and I'm only taking a shower now because I was on TikTok. <laughs> but anyway, to feel better and be a little bit more productive, I'm going to do a face mask right now. And then Ratin and I are going to go get some kawaii. I also want a coffee. Do I want a coffee, though? Yeah, I want a coffee. If anyone forgot or didn't see that video or whatever, this is the Himalayan charcoal purifying glow mask from Body Shop. I don't know if I can say it's being super helpful and stuff. I just use it because it makes my skin feel nice. And that's pretty much it. Can you see where if I stand this far? I'm so tired of bending. I'll just kneeling just for content. Imagine. And I need to see it in my feet. Like, it just feels so good when you're putting it on. So like, I'm just gonna keep buying it. You use it like, they say twice a week, but I have been using it like maybe once a week. I don't know, I think they said two to three times a week. I hope everyone is having a great New Year though. Or had a great New Year celebration, New Year's Eve thing. I literally stayed home because <laughs> I have strict parents. <laughs> So I was literally in my room, I was journaling, I wanted to start my vision board, but then I just told myself I'll wake up early and do it. And did I wake up early? No. But I'm still gonna get it done for sure. Like I know it's gonna motivate me so much and really like force me to like actually get my goals done and all of that and not just like go with the flow. That's exactly what I did. Like besides school obviously. But like in terms of life in general last year i was just literally going with the flow and i don't want to do that is that right 
See, it just, like, you know, when I got this name, I literally said to the shop lady, like, when she was like, oh, what kind of mask are you looking for? I was like, hey, bro, I'm looking for one of those masks that people like to do on the social media. I'm looking for one of those masks that a lot of people like to do for vibes. I'm not doing it for, like, any certain, like, skin conditions or... But maybe I'll be more invested in my skincare this year. That would be fun. I should probably set a timer right now. BRB. I don't know how long I was talking to you guys for, so now I don't know how long I'm supposed to set it. Mm, okay, it's giving. I'm gonna say it's been on my face for three minutes, and maximum you can keep this on your face is 10 minutes, so I'm gonna say maybe six minutes. As I was saying, man, let's have a little chit chat. This is gonna be a year. See, the problem that I have, man, with like planning ahead and being more organized and stuff is that like i'm always so scared like okay but what if it doesn't go that way like if i said like on my planner maybe tuesday i'm gonna go to gym at 9 30 and then tuesday comes and i'm like do i have to go to gym at 9 30 what if i want to go at 1 30 and all of that stuff and i think it's it's really been contributing to why i'm so like i'm not disorganized but i'm not like the most organized that I can be, but I'm gonna definitely try to be better this year. Again, I wanna say, I wanna say new year, new me, but new year, me. <laughs> oh, and also this brush is also from the body shop. I literally just asked for a brush that you use to apply face masks because I had nails on for the whole of December and I was not going to use my fingers to toss other thing as I have been doing for the past two years now. This year I just I don't know. I just I wanna become the version of myself that I've been planning in my head for years now. Someone who like, you know, works hard to achieve every single goal that I want to achieve. Like I can't be like I'm gonna achieve seventy percent in school and then like one assignment comes and I'm like not putting my best effort into it. I don't wanna do that right this year, you know? Like I really wanna try my best in everything. Like this month I'm really gonna take the whole C plus plus I'm C plus plus. I'm done with that. I'm gonna take like my whole Java learning thing seriously or self-study thing seriously before I get to school. Because when I get to school I'm going to make sure that I ace the modules that I have this year because like I'm so tired of being like ah oh, as long as I pass <sighs> good marks obviously will make you feel good I'm not going to like chill and like just tell myself whatever marks I get is fine like I'm gonna make sure to try my best because I know it's gonna make me feel good that I've tried my best do you get me? That's a tea there. Yo, let me shower, wash us off. Maybe I'll chat to you guys a bit later. Like, just about how I'm feeling about the new year. Oh, I literally had a crisis at midnight about the new year. Well, not really about the new year, but like, I don't know, bro. I was just feeling so anxious. But we'll get into that later, maybe. Yeah. See you guys now, now. Well, I got so excited to film that I completely forgot that I'm supposed to wash my face. Like, you know, like normal washing my face before I apply the stuff, bro. I mean, it doesn't, it probably doesn't make that much of a difference, but it's like, it literally even says in the instructions, like, apply to a cleansed face. Like, why would you put a face mask on a dirty f <laughs> And then quick update, I now just use my aqueous cream on my face. The body shop cream that I usually use, well, besides the fact that it's expensive, it finishes so fast. And then I have to get a new one like almost every single month. And then I was just like, hey, bro, this cream, this aqueous cream already does fine for my face. So it's like, do I need to get the body shop one? But I really do like the body shop one. I can't lie. So I think I'm probably going to restock either this month or like for when we get back to school next month. I open on the 20th of February. Can you imagine? I still have more than a month at home. A month and a half. Yeah. And then also the face wash that I use for my face now. 
Um, I still really like the Body Shop like foamy face wash that I usually use. But for the last few months, I think since November, after I ran out of the Body Shop one, I was like so tired of spending so much money every month on skincare. So then I started to use the Dove um bar so most of the time it's a sensitive one but even if it's a normal one i've been using that you guys know which one i'm talking about yeah and it's it's been fine for my face so far tbh i think but then the only thing is that i need to make sure all the time that i wash my face twice a day like if i don't wash it twice a day then the breakouts so update i was feeling quite confused as to what i should do so there's a journal that i need to get because i want to start like new year new journal kind of, and the shop closes at five you know like uh, when you google like when does the shop close and then can they the times are not updated because of the public holidays and stuff because it's new year's day so i tried maybe calling the shop and then like obviously if they pick up then clearly they still in store but they didn't pick up so i'm just gonna assume that they're closed because i'm not gonna drive for mahala yeah so i think i'm just gonna like journal for today in my current notebook but i'll get a new one tomorrow and then just like transfer what i wrote there otherwise yeah we're about to go to Kauai. so we made it to Kauai. it's so pretty what's oh, new now is it so pretty hey we got our food yay and it's behind the seat belt <laughs> it's belt seated and she got a smoothie as well vibes very dairy and we got the usual, it's just the princess wrap. Bro, can you guys imagine? Before I get copyrighted. Can you guys imagine? We get to Vida Cafe, they are closed. Now what? Now what? To go check out Seattle Coffee, and I was not feeling like Seattle Coffee today. That is fine, I don't mind. Okay. Oh my gosh, continue making noise. Just continue. Just do it. Do it. I'm watching JJK. <laughs> it tastes so good. And I'm sure it's because the kawaii is new. It's giving. It's even like already this movie. It just, wow. So, update. Right now, it's about 10 to midnight. 10 minutes to midnight. And yeah, I tried to get my productivity up when I last saw you guys in the previous clip um but literally watched like so many episodes of um jujutsu kaisen like it was maybe 9 p.m and you know we're thinking time for supper or whatever because we didn't cook today so ended up getting like some mcdonald's not very proud of it i wasn't even that hungry to begin with but yeah literally when i tell you i'm productive like i was supposed to finish this journaling part of my vision board this morning you know wow only now it's midnight and we still need to do the dishes too and haven't done that definitely not my favorite way to start off the year if i'm being completely honest but i'm gonna try my best to like make it better from tomorrow and i'm very serious about it I need to do this thing of like when I say tomorrow, then I actually mean tomorrow and not like continue procrastinating forever because who's that gonna benefit? Not no one, not me. Don't mind my energy right now. I feel so tired. And it's like, I don't even know why I feel so tired because I woke up so late. So I don't even know why I'm tired. It's like, you know, when you get tired from like doing nothing, that's me right now. I. <sighs> I hate having unproductive days. I only enjoy a proper unproductive day when it's like I've had like a really long school week and then it's Friday night and like I just want to sit in my room and just watch like anime the whole night and then go to sleep and like I did nothing for that day or whatever. You know, that's the only time that like I'm like feeling good about being unproductive but then when it's like i've just gone through a whole month of holiday and i feel like i have not made much progress in like the stuff that i wanted to make progress in but i guess that's the concept behind a new year it's like a new it's like a reset 
and all of that so yeah i'm, I'm definitely i'm gonna try again try this whole thing of being the best version of myself um tomorrow i think in my next video like i will show you guys my completed vision board i'm actually very excited about that oh what was i saying i had earlier i mean i had an existential little crisis okay maybe not midnight on the dot but it was like maybe one in the morning and i didn't feel ready for the new year or maybe because my new year was like pretty underwhelming usually like i'm screaming like happy new year every year like my whole life i've always had a fun new year's eve like if it's not like you know going to like like spending time with all my extended family relatives with all the fireworks and the loud music outside if it's not that then like it's spending new year's eve with like uh, with us like a bunch of people my friends whatever the case you know but like this time it was very and i'm not used to that yeah i think from the underwhelming feeling then like i just started to feel like oh my gosh am i really ready for like another start another january another february another march another semester oh my god oh my god, oh my god. And, like i started also thinking like oh my gosh i'm turning 21 this year and it's like I'm turning 21 this year. But then I prayed a bit, sat with myself a bit, and yeah, calmed myself down. And started to get quite excited about the year. Yeah. I think I need just a bit more to be excited about. The stuff that I wrote for my um, goals and stuff, most of it kind of remained the same. Last year, especially like, I was so excited that, oh my gosh, I was going to be on campus for the first time ever. Oh my gosh, I'm going to make classmates for the first time ever. And I was like, I'm just doing the same thing. Contrary to doing the same thing, I'm doing new modules this year that like I've never done before. And you sure last year, half the year, I did modules. Okay, fine, it's only two modules. I did two modules that I did the previous year. Actually three, because art is like a continuation from first year art module like it's literally like more complex but same storyline same comic same character kind of vibe so i think i was also quite anxious about that because it's been a while since i've like done something that's actually new at school but i'll be fine i just need to keep like reminding myself that there's quite a bit to be excited about this year and like there's so much time to complete the goals that i want to complete to really improve myself the way i want to improve myself yeah anyway i talk too much maybe this should be in like a get ready with me you know when people put like get ready with me chit chat no <laughs> the title goes chit chat get ready with me except this time i'm not getting ready for anything <laughs> Yeah, I'm getting ready to go pack dishes. That's what. I think also what's gonna definitely motivate me tomorrow is that number one, I'm going to gym tomorrow. This is Monday. I'm getting a new journal tomorrow. If anyone's wondering, the journal that I have is from the brand Moleskine. If anyone's heard of Moleskine, from exclusive books. Definitely been my favorite brand so far. This is partially because I love Moya Mohenny's <laughs> YouTube videos. But like she always uses a dotted journal and like ever since i've just been such a fan of dotted journals but so i'm gonna keep that vibe going i hate line journals i don't know what, what it is about it are the lines too big for me like the spaces in between i don't know i don't know maybe i'll update you guys about what i'm doing tomorrow when i get to tomorrow maybe it's gonna be more exciting than it was today thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for the support like honestly if it wasn't for you guys like this heavily contributes to <laughs> me feeling motivated i cannot lie it's like i love the sense of like having a routine so this definitely puts me in a routine you know and a fun routine because i get to talk to you guys and if your new year is not really going as planned or like you're also not feeling so motivated and stuff then try your very best to force the year to be your year because if you don't make it fun no one else is gonna do it for you you have to do it for yourself you know and that hot girl hot person aesthetic mindset we're forcing it if it's not coming to you naturally you will force it to come to you when they say force every year to be your year 
that kind of vibe yeah hello guys it's the next day now you see what i was saying i don't know maybe i had an epiphany or something but i am motivated to get my tasks done for the day and i even wrote them down and i'm really motivated to get them done and i'm really excited about them so i'm gonna go to gym and i'm gonna go to the mall to get a journal the journal that i was talking about and then i'm gonna go sit in starbucks and do all the stuff that i need to do and then later i'm gonna look at a job so i will give back to you guys at the end of the day to see if like i've actually done all of this exciting bye Okay, yeah, update. I did complete most of the things that I needed to complete that day. I even managed to hang out with one of my best friends. But the following day, I made sure to complete, like, everything. I even got back into reading. Almost done with my vision board. You get the vibes. Period! If it's morning for you, have an amazing day forever. If it's afternoon, have an amazing evening. If you're about to sleep, good night. Sweet dreams. And I'll see you in my next video. Peace out. Thank you.